What's up, savages? So you want to know the secret to getting more FPS while streaming? And you would literally do anything to fix the problem? Maybe you just started streaming and you're looking to bring your viewers a higher quality stream instead of that 20 FPS stream. Maybe getting low frames is making you look bad on stream and you just need that little FPS boost to finally win your first match. If you're someone like me who started streaming out with low frames, then this is the video for you. Here's two helpful secrets that nobody knows about that will help you get more frames while streaming. Welcome back. My name is Wesley, AKA the Calm Cool Savage, and I'll be your Twitch hack for the night. This is the new series on the channel dedicated to helping amateur and beginner streamers on Twitch. If you're a gamer who's been living under a rock and you don't know what FPS is, no, we're not talking about first person shooters. We're talking about frames per second. This is the number of times the image on the screen is refreshed each second. What a lot of people don't know is that when you first start streaming and you're playing a game, it's pretty much playing the game twice. So it shoots up your CPU and your FPS goes down, causing your stream and your gameplay to look like this. But with these two secrets that I'm about to share with you guys, your stream can look like this. Lots that people have figured out nowadays. It's so cool. Friendly Harriers in what, what there's a goat, a bloke. Uh, oh, did you see that for some skill, mate? <laughs> I'll take that. So you're probably like calm cool savage. Tell us the secrets. Now. If you're ready to hear the two secrets, then come here. Come closer. Come here. Let's talk about that. So my first secret to getting more FPS while streaming is background resolution. Now, if you're playing a game and you're dropping a lot of frames, I recommend this highly. It's simple. All you have to do is go to the setting of the game you're playing, where it says resolution, set this to 1280 by 720. After you set your resolution, you're gonna wanna exit out of the game and restart it. Now, before you relaunch the game, right click and click on display settings. You're gonna wanna set your resolution to the same resolution that you set the game to. And now for a secret number two. This is a really easy, simple step to getting more frames while streaming. Minimize your game and in the taskbar, right click it, right click the game again and go to properties. Click on the compatibility tab and down below, click on disable full screen optimizations and apply. And by doing these two simple tricks, you can gain up to 30 to 40 FPS while you're streaming. This is a really awesome trick for those streamers out there who don't have a good PC, but they're trying to build something for themselves and they're trying to start with what they have. There's plenty of games out there that I actually have to do this myself because I don't have a good enough PC yet. So I can promise you guys that this tip works 100%. And there's my two secrets to getting better FPS while streaming. When I first started streaming, I had low FPS and then I tried out these secrets and they helped me a lot. I hope they can help you too. If you guys like the channel and you like the video, you like the content here, I also stream over at twitch.tv slash calmcool savage if you would like to check out the channel link in the description i'm on the road to 3k follows i do a lot of gaming streams skateboarding streams i also like to hang out with my community and watch videos and just chat i play with all my viewers and we have an amazing community that's growing every day aka the savage pack come on in join the fun it would be awesome to see you guys in the stream if you have any questions or you're looking for more tips on how to get even more fps comment down below i could do more videos like this in the future also, if you guys like the video, slap like, and if you enjoy the content on the channel, punch out that sub button. I'm your host, Calm Cool Savage, signing off.